Hello everybody, hope you're all well. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to a brand new video. I'm back with a vlog today and today is a come shopping with me in the USA and I'm starting today's vlog outside somewhere that I have never been to before. We are outside the Dollar Tree, which I'm very excited about. So we're gonna start off there. Right outside the door, they have these pool noodles, which are great to make wreaths with. If you wanna make an oversized wreath, there's loads of DIYs that you can do with these. One dollar, that's so good. Come straight and see the Christmas decorations. At the stars, but now it feels just like I wandered off into a room and closed the door behind me. I never gave the key to you, even though I wanted to. I should be trying something new, but now my body's sick. I'm tired of dwelling in the dark, it's just that my heart can't take it. I didn't know what it would cost me when I let you go. Feel alone, and I'm just singing. Mm, mm, it should have been you. Another time, another place. I just know mm, it could have been you. What a crime and what a shame to let go. Mm, sometimes I just don't know what to do. It should have been you. They have so many party supplies here. Lots of craft supplies for Christmas time. They've got these clear baubles that you can fill up. And these are quite cool. They're like little jars. This is cool, they've got all these rocks that you can put into vases. Don't see that in the UK. And bags of shells too. Loads of stickers and stencils. Some really good craft stuff in here. They've got lots of faux flowers as well and all the um, oasis and foam pieces to display them in. This is cool, look they do pieces of craft wood. So handy, so many different DIYs you can do with that. Look at all these pieces, I love that. And they have these pre-cut shapes too. Just come for a look in the DIY section and they've got some really nice peel and stick tile here. Looks really 3D. And they've also got this style here, which is more like a wood effect. I love these though. How good is that? I'm actually tempted to get some of those. This is handy. They have all these on the go items for just a dollar each. They've got banana boat, sunscreen, they have a little mouthwash, cocoa butter, some Nivea products, little shower gel bottles. This is cool. I love that. For just a dollar, that's brilliant. I like the brass design of that. Just looking at all these sweets now. They have a great selection here and they also have all the crisps too. Popcorn, cheese balls, 
Wish I had a bigger suitcase, I'd take so many of these home. <laughs> they have some really cute little storage jars in here, with different patterns on them. Sweet, it's like a miniature bin, but for pencils. They do these garden dishes. If you want to have a shallow little display. Oh wow, I've just seen this wreath base just on its own here. Hopefully I'll be able to find the section where that came from. Look at some of these glasses. That is a tankard and a half. <laughs> I was told there'd be wine. Enjoy every moment. Rosé all day. These plates are nice. Look at this lovely turquoise colour. That's so nice. These are cool. They have these foil backsplash wall stickers. So you can stick them, you know, behind areas that are going to get splashed. But they only have the, um, <laughs> wine is my favourite fruit ones. They don't have this one. If they had that, I would have been tempted to pick some of those up. What a good idea. Well, I enjoyed my look around Dollar Tree. It did not disappoint. I wish I could have bought a few more bits, but I managed to get some really nice stuff actually. Some things for a DIY project and also some really nice autumn kind of decor bits. So yeah, I'll do those in a future haul. And now I'm wandering along to try and find Hobby Lobby because I think it's this way. I just noticed as well that the leaves are starting to change colour here too. So I think fall is well on its way. Have a look at these. Here we go. I'm astonished at the size of this place. Let me just see if I can give you a little 360 to give you an idea of how big some of these aisles are. Oh wow! <laughs> Let's start at the wreath section. Wow, they've got all the different sizes. Then we have the foam ones. whole section of fabrics where you can get them measured and cut to size. Look at the colours. Oh this is cool, a shadow box so you can display all memories in here. I love that idea. They've got all these display containers too. They've got one here for a ball. They've literally got something for everything in here. Wow, it's like a dream shop to me. Look at these frames. Just checking out the Sharpie section. <laughs> you know I love my Sharpies. They've got some specialist ones. And now we have the section of small shelves, which is a large section. <laughs> of small shelves. This one's nice. 
look at the choice we have here. I didn't realize they did so much in the way of kind of small home home pieces too. This one's cool with the hooks on it. Look at the size of that. Got some lovely bits. So much choice. Oh, I like this. This is like a narrow shelf that you can prop things onto. Have a faux kind of window here. That's a cool idea. If you want to make a plain wall look a bit more interesting or for like a downstairs bathroom or something like that. If it doesn't have a window in it. All these signs. I just love the fact that they do themed soap dispensers here. It just makes my day. <laughs> they have so much stuff for autumn or for fall as we call it here. Look at this little napkin holder. Look at these salt and pepper pots I think. section and here we have a entire aisle dedicated to Christmas stocking. Actual entire aisle. <laughs> this is madness but I love it. With all these large Christmas decorations which are humongous. Really nice if you're decorating outside. Look at all the baubles. Every colour you could imagine. Wow. Here we have all the Christmas mugs. Oh, look at this. That is so cool. From Home Alone, I love that. So much in here. I know I keep saying it, but they really have got everything. Look at these guys. All these storage containers. Oh my goodness, if I had a house as big as the ones here in America, or if I lived here in America, I would have an absolute field day. Oh my goodness. It's just so exciting in here. Look at this. Hello. <laughs> They've actually got Christmas artwork. I mean, is that a thing? I didn't know that was a thing. Wow. I love this. <laughs> it's so cool. No. 
Got all the crafts here, so they've got all the ornaments ready for crafting. Decorate your own. Some stickers. Okay, we've gone quite specialist now, but I'm just intrigued to see how much this store offers. We have clock making equipment here. We have all the wooden dowel poles in different sizes here and then different knobs. Matt line one please, Matt line one. Thank you. Have the clothes pegs, the old fashioned style. Dane call two seven, Dane two seven. And then so many different wooden containers of different sizes. They have these DIY balloon arches. That's great, isn't it? So you can just make your own. Love that idea. That was so cool. Oh my goodness. I knew that it was gonna be big. A lot of you have said that Hobby Lobby is a big place, but I didn't realize it was gonna be that big. I didn't realize they'd be having full aisles dedicated to quite specific things like Christmas stockings or socks, whatever you call them, or yeah, every single hobby that you can imagine in there. I would spend so much time in this place if I lived out here. It was brilliant. But yeah, I'm gonna end this vlog here because I think it's got quite long. I'm going to go over and head to the Goodwill to do a spot of thrifting, which I'm going to do in a separate video. Hope you enjoyed this one. If you're new here, don't forget to click subscribe to new videos every single week. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and let me know down in the comments below if you've ever been to a Dollar Tree or a Hobby Lobby, and if you have, what you think of them. Or let me know if anything caught your eye as we were going round too. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you soon. Bye.